Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody brought up a good point and a kind of a good question. When sometimes when I open a document, the page is like this big instead of being full screen. Well, you know, if you got the zoom tool in your hand, you can hit zoom to page. If you don't have the zoom tool, you can shift F4, you know, do the same thing. But that's two keys that are pretty far apart. Now, this isn't a very good picture of a keyboard, but the shift keys here and the F4 there, even with my big hands and kind of a dimly, dimly lit room, I do it with two, two hands. They brought up, why don't you use the shift Z key? It's not being used for anything. So let's just do it. Go to tools, options, customization, go to commands, Anywhere in this search box, I mean, you could go down and find, you know, where it is, but just type in Zoom. You don't even have to finish typing it. There, Zoom to page. Shift F4. Well, let's just type a new one. Shift Z. Assign it. Say OK. Now let's just hit Shift Z. See what happens? Let's get rid of that box and Shift Z. It'll bring up no matter where this thing is on the page. Shift Z. And that's a good another good point right there. I had a couple items left over. You know, like right here. If you're ever working on your work and you've left something off the side, you can't see it, just hit your F4 key and it'll bring up everything on or off the page. I always do that and hit delete, then hit F4 again, and it brings up whatever I need. But this is pretty cool having the Shift Z right there together. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.